Hello, Detective. Gabriel Whiting, FBI. Feds. Why am I not surprised? Oh, Mr. Hotshot, perhaps I should just go home, kick off my shoes, have a nice cup of cocoa, because it sounds like you've got the case figured out. Would I be here if I did? Educate me. Indeed. For the past two years, I've been working with the OCU trying to take down New York's top crime syndicates. But things always go wrong. Stakeouts go cold. Covers get blown. <laughs> Sounds like you just suck at your job. I was on the job when the best part of you was running down your mother's leg, Detective, anyway. We figured there's gotta be a mole in the department. Detective Higgins was onto something. He had evidence. Was ready to name names. That's what he had in that briefcase, huh? So what the fuck happened? There's obviously a conspiracy at play, a setup. I believe you can help me find out who's behind it. Now how you figure that? Terry Higgins. He asked me to bring you in should anything go wrong. Look, I want to know the motherfuckers as much as anybody. I ain't even got a hunch. I mean, in case Terry didn't mention it, I'm pretty new here. That's why you're perfect, Detective Reed. See, we don't know who's on the take. Anybody could be the bad guy, and that's the catch. You gotta do this alone outside of your official duties. No support, huh? You arrest anyone connected with this investigation, I'll make sure they do not pass go. Gather enough evidence on the mole, we will bury him together in a deep, dark cell. Have we got a deal? Where do I start, man? We know that these four crime syndicates have been in contact with the mole. You shake them down, you will find Terry's killer. I've collected some details. Rather scanty, I'm afraid, but they should get you started. Yo, Gabriel. I hate this cloak and dagger shit. The Magdalena Cartel is the city's prime coke syndicate. Even conservative estimates have these guys running 75% of the five boroughs flow. It's a shadowy organization, leadership unknown, but we're certain that the top dog lives in Manhattan so he can keep a close eye on distribution. Now, before Terry died, he said he made the acquaintance of one Teresa Castillo, known around town as Mother Teresa. I met the real Mother Teresa once on a mission in Cambodia. You'd never know it by looking at her, but a very funny woman. I should write a book. Anyway, this Teresa Castillo, she's a rich socialite, runs shelters all over the city. Terry believed she had information to help us crack the cartel. You can find her at the Wellness Clinic in Spanish Harlem. Miss Castillo, I need a word with you about the Magdalena Cartel. I'm sorry, I am a busy woman. If you're a reporter looking for another... Detective Reed, New York Police. Oh, I see. Look, officer, I've grown weary of talking to the police. No matter how many times I complain about the dealers, nothing is ever done. You just write your reports and yes me away. Well, I ain't like that, lady. I come from the kinds of places you're trying to help. Is that so? Then why is that dealer still up there on the corner? Get him off my street. And I don't mean just shoo him away like your fellow officers. I mean permanently. All right, I think I can do that. But don't you go nowhere. I'll be right back. Hey, homie, let me holler at you for a minute. Yeah. What you need, man? Same bag? 20 sack? Or ounce? Or what? But you to bounce the fuck out of here and don't look back. Right, I got it? Fuck you! Come on! I th ah! 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 You're a I tried to be peaceful. You all forced my hand. Walk away from this!
Get him! Get him! Get him! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Drug stores now blow! That dealer? <laughs> he ain't coming back. You got my word on that. I have to say, you have a rare determination for a cop. You're going to need it. The cartel is an army. You mean the Magdalenas? Magdalenas, the Lords, the Curls. Many names, same source. A major crack processing facility right here in the city. So how do I find it? I've been funding the Smith projects in Alphabet City. I can tell you this. Three times a day, a motorcycle courier supplies the stoop dealers and collects their cash. Sounds like a runner where I'm from. A piece of advice. Grab yourself a motorbike or you'll lose him. He takes a route no police car could follow. Aight then. Let's see what kind of shit I can get into. 